let's talk revenue streams. Troy, I guess you can start with Shard. What, what are the revenue streams? Because you guys have so many different things coming in. I'm thinking can about it as you're saying. The different revenue streams for yeah. our audience? We got, well, we got the podcast audio. Yep. Yep. We got YouTube. Mm-hmm. We, we have merch. We have EYL University. We have our affiliate links. Um, we have Patreon. Patreon. We have um, the tour is stopped right now, so I'm not going to count that. But whenever we can go back out touring again, um, live events, that's definitely a revenue stream. Trucking. Um, yeah, the truck. We got a truck. It's, it's not on the road yet, but in the next couple of weeks, the truck, EYL trucks will definitely be on the road. So that'll be a revenue stream. Uh, I think that might be it, right? Did you mention sponsorships? I don't know if that was in there. I mean, yeah, yeah. well, we did. I put that in the audio, like in the audio. Affiliates. Affiliate links. Yeah, affiliates. That's that's definitely a big revenue stream. Uh, so yeah, that's nine. Okay, so 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 let's talk about let's talk about in terms of the top three. I mean, I'm, I'm interviewing y'all like I'm on EYL. <laughs> y'all ask very specific questions, which I love. <laughs> What are the biggest revenue streams for, for, for EYL? Um, the biggest ones is the university, the um, affiliate, depending on the month. So would, they, would the university be the number one revenue stream? Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, the university, affiliates, um, audio, podcasts, and then YouTube. He gave you four. Those are, the, <laughs> yeah. Those are the top four. Those are the top four. Good. Yeah. Good. Do you guys do any marketing at this point? Or have you ever done marketing? Yeah. We do marketing. So, what is the what do those ad spins look like? We do marketing for the university for sure. Yeah. I mean, we again, like, and you it's a testament. You saw when you came here, like we we shooting everything ourselves. And so mm-hmm. like we are the producer, we are the director. We are the creative team for our ads. We write our own scripts and all that. So yeah, everything is in-house and we, we should definitely shoot ads for the university and um and any do we, we have any for the not any for the podcast to promote, but definitely for the university. Yeah, we do ads um on Facebook, Instagram, and in our podcast. We always have an ad in our podcast for our university. We um, you know, Instagram. We advertise on Instagram sometimes. Um so do you advertise on YouTube? Yeah, in in episode. Like we always put an ad in inside of the episode. Inside of the episode, but you're not actually spending money directly with YouTube. We have it. I don't think we I don't think we have run YouTube ads yet. No, yeah. Huh? But um that's something that we definitely probably look into this year though. Okay, you said that you guys do have done or do Facebook and Instagram um ads for the university. Is this something that is ongoing? Is it something that you guys do here and there? It's ongoing. Um, yeah, we, we do that all, every day. We, um, you know, we just got to change up the ads and do different ads depending on a different campaign or things change. But we've been running uh, Facebook ads pretty consistently probably for about five months now, six months. And it's good. Get a good, good return on your money anywhere from, you know, three times, four times. One time, depending on the, you know, depending on the month, uh, but we've always made money on it. It's just a matter of how how big the return is. Sometimes the return has been better than, than other times, but um, Facebook ads definitely work. Yeah. Definitely would recommend that to anybody that has a business. Um, it's a great way to uh, get in front of people and to push your product, and um, definitely has some has been something that we have. Um, invest the money in for sure. Yeah, definitely. You're, and I, I would just suggest everybody just allocate a budget for it. If it's $25 a day you want to do or hundred uh, $25 for the week, depending on how much you invest will determine how many eyes get to see it. So just keep that in mind. Who's running your ads? Are you guys doing that in-house as well? Um, we were, we was doing it in-house. Then we had, then we hired an ad team. Um, I think we might go back to doing it in-house. So, a combination of both. We we use outside resources, and we still use our, our ourselves sometimes too. It's another thing that Mike does. He he knows how to run Facebook ads. So um, yeah, combination of both. But we learned 
how to do it ourselves. So if we ever need to do it ourselves, we can at the very least run ads ourselves. We don't have to be solely relying on, on somebody else. Um, but we have used outside resources as well. Okay. And before I move on, what is it, what is your ad spend budget look like on a weekly basis? Um, we upped it. Uh, I think we're spending. Where, where did it start? And then tell me where, you, where did you up it to? I think we started like $50 a day. Yeah. And um, now we're spending like, I think $2,500 a day. 27, yeah, 27, $2,700 a day. Yeah. Hold on, excuse me? <laughs> 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 yeah. I, 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 I was waiting for you to correct that. <laughs> how, how much a day? Yeah, like like 2,700? Yeah. Every day? Yeah. yeah. Okay, beautiful. So yeah, I mean, the key to that is not to, to, I mean, it's gonna sound crazy, but like what you're spending is gonna be a certain amount, but the return, right? Cause he, he said like, we're gonna make money on it. It's just about yep, how much absolutely. we're going to. So that, that's key to keep in mind as well. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.